Hello, ladies and gentlemen, back again. Ten of a cheat with uh, here with another uh, playthrough of uh, Airship Conquerors, guys. I've um, I'm going to be doing, carrying with the mods that I like I did last time uh, again, and um, I've got uh, I've actually done a little bit of off, off off camera work this time because last time I tried to capture hypo hypo hypoborea about three or four times um, with absolutely zero, uh, zero success whatsoever. Um, so this time I've actually got, just gone ahead and done a bit of off camera work. It's a bit, a bit easier, I've captured this little corner here. Um, I've got myself a little army here, which I'm gonna show you. I've got some tadpoles, which I looked at last time briefly. I didn't actually realize that they're uh, kind of one shot like uh, kind of like darts, basically. I didn't realise they were kind of one-shot things, though. So um, that, uh, my friend uh, Tender Chief pointed it out, and he also pointed out some other ships that I could use um, that would sort of he recommended. So I've taken some of his advice again, as always. Um, I've got myself some fighters here, and I've got myself. I've also gone for some of the land ships. These bulldozers just look very interesting. So. <clears throat> I thought I would I would get that. Um, also, I found that actually this uh, it, it can um, can lag out the frame the frame rate actually drops a little bit with the, with the mods, which isn't um, isn't necessarily the end of the world, but it has given me a few troubles when I've been editing. So it's uh, things like uh, maybe some of the audio will get lost and things like that along the way, but hopefully it won't be too bad because sometimes when I when I change from between script between screens it just completely drops the frame rate and you don't actually none of it actually gets recorded so i'm sort of talking away and then all of a sudden the uh the video is out of sync with the actual um with the audio but anyway um it's not the end of the world um so oh this looks interesting so i'm just having a look at some of these some more of these ships here um got, got a bit more money now which is always always nice um this looks interesting. The generic two. Let's uh, let's give it a try. Let's have a look here. That looks looks uh, looks different. It's got it's got a whole lot of guns on there. Let's build, let's build this over here, um, and then we'll build something else. Oh, they're both building. Okay, so they're both building now. So I'm going to play this now. This is where it tends to drop off a little bit. So bear with me. Okay, so let's play. Okay, so it wasn't too bad that time. There was a little bit of a little bit of lag there, but it's not too bad. Um, oh, it's already built. So let's build another ship here as well. Um, hmm. I've got some defenses here as well, which I'll just show you actually quickly. So um, this is, as you can see, I've got quite a large, quite a large fleet already, which is quite nice. And and what is this? Oh, that's a ship there as well. I need to repair that, so I'll repair that now. But here, I've got some defenses here which are pretty hefty, and these ones here. I'm going to build a, f a couple of farms dotted around at some point as well. And there are apparently trade ships you can use which just basically generate you money as well. Um, but for the moment, this looks pretty much okay. Um, so yeah, we're going to leave this here. And we're going to let that build. Oh, it's, it's done building that. Let, let's let's build a uh, build a farm because we briefly touched on the last time. Um, but it's always nice to uh, sort of add a few farms in because it helps it helps with your money situation. See here, it gives you minus seven maintenance. That's one. That one's the same, but it's got. I think it's got more defenses, which is why it costs a little bit more. Uh, same with this one. I think they. Pretty much, well, that's minus four. You can see there's a different one. That's minus four because it's only half the size, but it's got a lot more um, uh, weapons on, on it. That's why it's uh, a little more expensive than the, the one that gives you minus seven. Um, and this one here gives you minus six. So there are different variations you can get off the farms, um, which is which is cool. Right? Gives you uh, gives you plenty of options to sort of uh, play with. But I'm still not. There seems like this. It looks like there's some kind of oil rigs or something like that on my actual. Um, look at this one here. Solid keep of crows. It looks like the keep of crows just kind of beefed up on steroids, basically. Um, but the oil rigs, I, I I haven't quite worked out, and and I haven't actually seen them uh, anywhere on here. It would take me a while if I just click 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 the whole time. 
and unable to load building. Some of these so it's a cataclysmic expansion pack. For some reason, it's un unable to load the buildings. I'm not sure what that is. I'll have to have a look at that off screen at some point. Um, but let's carry on what we've got so far. So I'm going to build a farm here, uh, which I think, yeah, here we go. So we've got quite a lot of defenses here. So let's just go for the minus seven and the cheapest one. That'll probably be the best. Yeah, just call it farm 1A3. It doesn't really matter too much what we call it. Um, I'm going to pop that there. Maybe I can always move them around later. Okay, so we'll leave that now, and yeah, we've got a ship building there, we've got some defences building here. See what I mean, it does it does occasionally lag a little bit, and the frames do tend to drop sometimes. We've got, got quite a lot, went down to 10 frames a second there. I'm not entirely sure why that is, but I'm going to um, have to look into that a bit more. But anyway, <clears throat> nothing a bit of um, bit of editing can't get, can't get rid of. So, here... Oh, we've got the generic two there now. So let's move this guy over here. I should have done this a while ago. Let's send in a spy. Thousand. Fire caused by a foreign agent has destroyed the great fastness. Oh my goodness, at Tenderton. You may need to strengthen your enemies, uh, your empire's secret police. Oh, no way. So they actually destroyed... Oh, man. I think they, yeah, they destroyed the great fastness, whatever that is. Um... That called bizarre. That is ridiculous. Oh my goodness, look at this one. That looks incredibly hefty. So the great fastness was destroyed. That's very frustrating. I might have to st um to <clears throat> Oh look at this. This gives this is a warehouse here. That's interesting. So this is a warehouse. It gives us minus eighteen, but it has quite a lot of guns on the front as well. So I think that's quite expensive, but it will increase our uh, our money. So let's let's pop one of these down. Um, I was going to say I think we're going to need to increase our um, secret police as well. So let's have a look at the empire details. Right, so we're on lax at the moment. Maintenance is minus nine. Fleet maintenance is minus six. Total is minus seventy seven. Um, so if we put up to medium, ah, so that's. We're losing. We'd lose about fourteen. A t fourteen. But that's not too bad. It will help us to to sort of stove off the secret attacks. Let's have a look at the uh, city here. See what they have. Farms. Basically, just f Are these farms. Are they building them? They're not quite finished yet. It looks that way. And they don't have much actually here. I think their fleet is elsewhere. I think it's up over here. So um, let's build another ship up here while we can, and then we're gonna. I think we will just mosey on in there and see what we can uh, see what we can take. Cool. Try and build something a little different now. Something we haven't built before. I've got one of those HMS Commerce. They're quite good, but the they actually um, they actually run out of ammunition very quickly. Um, so that's a bit. I see. Ah, I know why. Because actually, this this HMS Commerce actually makes us money, gives us minus four maintenance. Um, so it's probably best to leave them behind. <laughs> I didn't realise that, but never mind. They can be used as uh, some kind of um, uh, defences if need be. So this one's another Commerce. So maintenance is six Commerce, but it doesn't actually give us any money back. So. Um, Hmm, I think I'm just going to get something a little bit, yeah, I'll get one of these, just a little something, a little something something for the time being. Um, and then we're just going to, we're just going to invade. Um, maybe we'll move back and see what he's got first of all. Oh, he's coming to move. No, no, he's not. Let's have a look what kind of a fleet he has here. It's nothing that spectacular. So let's just do it. Let's invade. Here we go. So this is where another time where we might drop off frame rate wise. Okay, so hopefully we're back again there. Okay, so <clears throat> now here this is this should be quite interesting. I actually have <laughs> it's just a digger. There's no guns on it. There's nothing uh, nothing to sort of really do much. So I wanted to actually use it to ram some of the buildings. He looks like he's got rid of that. Well, maybe that farm was in was uh, 
in the process of being built and it hasn't actually been it hasn't actually finished yet so it's not showing up I might move this guy back and I'm gonna move this guy back because he's a commerce ship so I'll just let him do some long-range bombarding now this one was the big boy if we look in close here it's got one two three four is that another gun up there maybe five it's got a hot got quite a lot of uh, weaponry and firepower there so he'll, he'll sit, sit the back as well I'm gonna move these three together like so I might move them actually down here in front so we can tackle this here as a group and then I should have yeah these ones I know what I'm gonna do with these I've got two of these uh, tadpoles they're called I'm gonna just send them straight in and um, just see what they can do <clears throat> meanwhile see if these guys can cause some damage to this and then we'll, we'll bring these up in um, as reserve so let, let's get let's get started here we go ladies and gentlemen let's see what happens tadpoles ram here we go bang oh look at that oh my goodness that oh look at that <laughs> They are awesome. I take back everything I said. They are awesome. Right. Okay, let's move you guys up here. Now, why can't I select you? Okay, here we go. Now, can you move? I don't think we'll be able to move past him, actually, which is a bit unfortunate. But now let's move you through here a little bit. I'm not sure we're going to be able to get you around anywhere. So we're just gonna, I'll just move you up here and see if we can... Oh... What was that that just dropped? Something just dropped out the sky. Oh, I'm completely forgotten about these two up here as well. Right, so let's move and flip you two. Uh, where's the F? There we go. Move and flip over here. Hopefully they won't bombard into some of these. We'll see what happens. Right now, focus all your fire. I'm sure they already are doing on here. Um, can you? What's this here? Was that something I thought? Well, maybe I just miss, missed that one. <laughs> maybe it was there the whole time and I didn't see it. As an enemy ship, but let's move. No, don't go down. For, don't go. Oh, goodness. Right. Let's see if we can squeeze this one through the gap. Now, rat. Mm, this is going to be tricky. Squeeze yourself through if you can. So we've we've got we've got them from all sides here, which is pretty good. Now, ram yourself, bulldozer, bulldozer through, engines full power, nothing. <laughs> right, these guys look like they're taking quite the pounding though. Something's on fire and I got, yeah, it's this guy. Okay, let's move and flip you over here, see if we can get you away from that. Nope, you're just gonna, not gonna do anything. Oh, there we go, we're done anyway, that's awesome, okay. Brilliant. Excellent. So we've captured another. Uh, let's go for a gentle takeover. There's no need to be, no need to be brutal, is there? Now, okay. So we lost the uh, we lost the gnat there. Let's see. Oh, we've still got these tadpoles. That's pretty cool. I thought they would have just been, you know, I thought they were just gone after the first. But those gnat, those gnats, those sorry, those tadpoles were pretty pretty impressive. Right. Pause. Let's. We've got three thousand here. So let's. Um, Let's build some more ships, shall we? Now, um, let's design a ship. I want to open one of these ships that we had because it was quite, it was pretty cool uh, for a long range one. Uh, the one that I was, what is Black Winter? That sounds interesting. Um, but now let, let's stick to what I was going to do in the first place because I always go off on these tangents and I don't know what I'm doing. So let's stick to what I was going to do. It was the commerce ship that I, I briefly uh, looked at uh, a moment ago. And HMS, comma, 55th commerce. I think it's this one here. Let's open this, right? So you see here, um, it gives you minus four maintenance, which is which is fine. I'm not really sure. Trade stores, that's what does it there. Okay, now its lift is pretty good, but its service ceiling is very low, which is fine. But if you look here, it's ammunition. It's got a decent gun on the front, um, which would be nice to sort of sit back and 
do some damage from from a distance okay um but if we look at some of the some of the guns we can put on here for example my goodness look at these guns whoa this is awesome right um uh that's pretty cool um Oh, that's given me so many ideas. Maybe I'll have to do like uh, another playthrough later on just with fiddling around with these. But for now, um, let's go for... Oh, what's this? Autonomous. Charging station? Worker droids need to uh, periodically change or they risk deactivating the electric... Electric... <laughs> electrically... The electrically powered... Powered, my goodness... I just cannot speak today. Electrically powered mines that need to chain charge to store information commands. I'm not really sure what that's, what that's about, but never mind. Um, what I wanted to do, if you look here, it's got air sale is six, which is five. Minimum crew is five. Um, but where is the uh, the ammunition? Ammo is only five. It's very low, so it does it really doesn't last very long with its ammunition. You see here. Where is this? Let's get rid of that. See here, what is this? It's the cockpit there. Small propeller. It's quite slow. It should have some kind of ammunition. Maybe it doesn't have any ammunition at all. That's why it just it literally lasts a few moments and then it and then it uh, and then it will um, it will stop firing. Oh my goodness! There's so much cool stuff here. I should be looking at. Um, so. Now, um, I want to go to ammunition or kind of resources. There we go. Right, I want to put a, um, oh, look at this, oil, oil store. Well, that's, inc that's interesting. Uh, I want to put a small ammo store on top, but apparently I can't put it there or there. How about, can I put it underneath here? Hmm. I wonder how much that's affected the service ceiling a little bit, but not. No, I don't want to. I don't want to do that. I don't want to undo it. Um, I want to see if I move it a little bit like this. Will that make any difference? Let's see if I can put a corridor in. Hope, hopefully, that will actually make it accessible. Um, so if I put this here like this, and then put a corridor down to it, maybe that will change it. Where do I get corridors again from? It's been a while since I've built something uh, on here. Uh, it's a berth, it's a crow's nest. Nope, I don't need that. Maybe it's in basic. Uh, where was it again? <laughs> there we go, corridor. Found it, thank goodness. Okay, now, it's ammunition. Let's see how much ammunition it's got. It was down at the bottom, wasn't it? That's a bit better. 45. That's cool. I like that. I'm going to save the design. Um, I'm going to call it the HMS 55th Commerce um, TFC for Tenderfoot Chief. Okay. I'm going to save that and then I can is there a way I can refit it or just build it? Maybe I just need to build it. Let's just build it. And then I can refit the other one I already have. I have a few of those knocking about. Now, where is that one here? Do I need to? Oh, I need to wait for this to actually uh, to do that. Now, that's building. This one. Oh, yeah, we've got another and that here. We lost one here, so it's quite good that we've got another one waiting for us. Um, now... Let's build one more ship here, okay. Uh, let's see, something interesting, something different. We've got a whole lot of money now, so we should be able to build something a little bit. Let's build something that's, that costs a bit of money. Cutter class, I, I used that last time and I wasn't too impressed. It was very short range and I couldn't really, well, that's 5,000, that's why. That's, oh my goodness, 7,000, look at that, whoa. Um, HMS Merchantile. That's one of the one of the ones that we were we just kind of modded just a moment ago. What is this? That gives us maintenance minus forty two. Well, let's build that then. 
I mean, we don't even need to use it, really. It doesn't look like it has any armaments or anything, but, you know, we can stick it at the back and it's going to make us a whole lot of money. So let's play this momentarily. Let's, hopefully, we won't lose too many frame, frames here. Let's let's play. Oh, perfect. Just straight away. That's good. Okay, so he's moving up. This is building. That's taking a little while to build. The gentle takeover is happening slowly but surely. Um, here we go. Now let's have a look at the defenses here. Okay, so, my goodness, look at the size of this fleet this is going to cause a bit of lag when I take it into action I believe <laughs> let's repair this first of all okay and then when that's repaired there is no defensive building yeah, I understand that okay so once oh here we go right this has been built here okay let's move it over here now uh, let's refit the one we already have here where is that so it was the commerce here we go Repair. How do we refit? Is it refit? Um, open design. Uh, is that how we do it like that? And then we just refit. I believe so. Well, that's good. Now let's see if anything else needs repairing. Surprisingly, nothing does. Awesome. It's partly recovered from the war. That's good. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to leave it here because, oh my goodness, no, 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 move, 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 move. Oh, right, okay, well, we're going to have to do this one quickly. Okay, so that really dropped behind frame rate, frame rate wise there for a second. So, now, <clears throat> my goodness, what, this looks like a Klingon, some kind of Klingon destroyer. That is amazing. That's cool. Both of those are cool. We've got some thunder in the background as well. Um, if I remember rightly, though, I do have some pretty cast armaments here. So let's move this guy. I'm going to move him out first of all. Now, this one here looks like it's got a ridiculous amount of guns on it. So I'm going to move it up to the front a little bit like so. I'm going to move this one to the back a little bit. Now move this one forward as well. Like that. Now we want this one to be out of the way because it hasn't got as many, many armaments as this one here. Can I flip this? Can I flip it? Will it ah, yes. It's got a few more. Oh no, does it have more armaments on the front? Not really, but now I'm hoping even though I have no ships here, that these defences will hold out. I mean, they have done in the past. So, let's start and see what happens. Okay. Not under command. Why is that not under command? Okay. Who do you want to focus on, first of all? Let's focus on this guy here. So, no targets. No target available. Hmm. Oh, look at that cannon. My goodness. This thing looks like a beast. Look at that. Oh. This is apparently not under command, but it seems to be firing. Okay, focus your fire on... Oh, that cannon sounds terrifying when it fires. Oh. Oh, dear. That's put... Oh, my goodness. That's put a few holes in me. Now, hopefully, we can do enough damage to... Right, I tell you what, everybody focus your fire on this guy, because he just... He has got one hell of a cannon on him. Oh, that's that's good. We've hit him. We've done some damage. This thing looks incredibly impressive. I mean, just look at this thing. It's just... It's, it's tail is waggling. I mean, I have no idea why its tail is waggling. But, um, yeah, it's mm, not looking great, but, oh dear, it's, I'm not sure I can pierce that armor very well with these things, oh dear, <laughs> we may be losing this one here, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> oh, no, 
That was an explosion. God, these things look very impressive. No, I'm not sure what they are, but they, they're pretty cool. Well, let me click on them to give me an actual name, because I'd like to build some of these, actually. Okay. Hopefully they'll just flee. But maybe not. <laughs> I don't think I've got any big guns left to actually attack them with. This, this cannon here might be able to do some damage, but the rest of them are just kind of pea shooter weapons. Oh no. These guys look, they look like they've hardly been touched. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna speed mm, I don't know if speeding up would be a good idea. Maybe we put it on like there we go. Put it on a little bit more, just a little faster. Oh no. Help. <coughs> oh oh gold. That is completely gone. Now they're just gonna motor up, mo mosey on through. Oh yep, yeah. come on, keep it, keep attacking it. Why are you out of ammunition? It looks like he's out. Well, I don't even know. I don't know why it's not under command either. It's incredibly frustrating. Oh god, goodness! <laughs> These guys are just taking me to town. I mean, that guy's out for the count. I wonder if he can hold on. Just hold him off. See if you can focus your p fire on him. See if he does anything. Maybe they run out of ammo now. Let's speed this up and hope that uh, we can do something to him. What's he doing here? Is he going to ram? Oh, he looks like he's tickling me with his waggly things. I'm not sh exactly sure what he's trying to achieve with that, but um, yeah, this is going on, going to go up some time. <laughs> okay. Stalemate. <clears throat> Come on. Now he's coming in to give me a tickle with his waggly things. Now he's gone back again. <laughs> and they stop waggling now. Oh. It looks like he's, he's taking some damage. Well, oh, out of ammunition. <laughs> so we're just sitting here. <laughs> what are you going to do, huh? Okay, they had to uh, run away. This is ridiculous. Right, I'm going to pause this quickly. Move him back there. See if I can repair anything. No. Nope. I'm gonna build a building here. Something 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 pretty awesome. That can actually uh it's got a bit of clout to it. Old mate class. It's got a few cannons there, I think. Looks pretty good. Radiant fortress. Um solid keep of crows now. Yeah, let's build that. That looks pretty damn solid. Okay, and we're going to pop this here. And then when we, once we've built that, we're going to move these guys back here. And then we shall be in business. Okay, I'm going to pause this here, though. I'm going to end it because I have to go uh, and do some work and things like that, unfortunately. Otherwise, I'd love to play this for a little longer. Um, but uh, the mods have been the mods have, mods have been pretty interesting. They put a bit more spice back in the game for me. They've been a lot of fun. Um, as always, uh, please comment and like the video, and uh, always subscribe if you would like. Feel free to. <laughs> and thanks for watching. And uh, I shall see you again soon. Okay. Bye bye.